Hey, okay, so it is December 15th today and we're in the middle of construction in our living room. So it's kind of crazy here. Our tree is not decorated, nothing's going on, but I'm trying to be a little festive with an apron and some little holly earrings that my mother-in-law gave me years ago. Anyways, I'm going to clean up my fridge a little bit. I haven't went grocery shopping since December 1st and it's the 15th and kind of check to see what I have still to use up and what I need to use and if there's anything that is going bad that I need to check out and figure out what what to do. This is kind of what I do two weeks in and then I try not to go grocery shopping again for another week but we have Christmas so I don't know. We will see. We will see what happens. Anyways, you want to peek in my fridge? This is my fridge. So we have some things that are here that are older and some that are newer. I'm going to be closing this and opening this as we go along because the beeping drives me bonkers. So these are the strawberries that are from December 1st. They're two weeks old. Normally around this time I'd be moving them to a smaller jar, but I actually don't have a half gallon jar that's available right now. <laughs> I was peeking around and I don't have an empty one. If I had a smaller jar, I'd be putting those in there. Um, about this time. So here's some grapes that we have left over. This is the actual strawberries in the jar, one that strawberries should be in, but that one doesn't have a label. I'll see if I can move these down. These might fit in a quart size jar, which I do have available. I still have a half gallon size. So anyways, two weeks old grapes. The beeping is kind of driving nuts. Some orange juice. I normally just hold the lid on and give it a shake. This is all back up. These are Brussels sprouts. They are from, let me grab a couple things over here in the closest. I'm trying to remember when I bought those Brussels sprouts. If they were from November or, or December? Oh yeah, I think they were the December grocery shopping trip. Because I had some in September that I had for two months. I haven't opened these in a while and I want you to hear what it does. So, did you hear that? So, those smell like Brussels sprouts, so. Um, as much as the strawberries smell really good when you open them, these will smell like Brussels sprouts um, or radishes. And this is one thing that I don't wash um, when I put in the jar. So I just put them in the jar when I come home. And then when I go to cook them, I cut off this end right here, that part, and then just a couple of the leaves fall off. So they're still totally good, this extra condensation. I'm just going to wipe that out just a little bit. I'm not going to go crazy in there. Just... There's some down here too, but I'm not worried about that. Okay, close this back up. And there, we'll probably have this for Christmas at some point. This was something that people were asking me about. I've never put mushrooms in a jar before, and they asked if you could do it, and they all look really great. So I put these in a jar the same time that I put these in the bag, because the bag is how I normally store them if I'm gonna store them in the refrigerator. But they look exactly the same. Check this out here. 